That's Chester. Oh, Chester. <laughs> yeah. Pretty good this morning. Uh, and uh, joining us as well, because we're talking about the Pet Lovers Expo, we have um, uh, Melissa Rusk joining us from Laws, which is the Lanark Animal Welfare Society, and also a store that I know Sarah Freemark has, uh, has been to uh, from Pause a bit. We have Ashley at Chivers. Great to have you guys both here. Thank you. So uh, there's a big event happening on uh, Saturday down in Merrickville, uh, and it's benefiting Laws. So for people who are, aren't familiar with Laws, Kind of run down what it is you guys are doing. Sure. We are a uh, not-for-profit, no-kill animal shelter in the Lanark County, and we also fulfill the role of the municipal pound for the ver 11 mun municipalities in the area. So, Is it busy? Very, very busy. Right now, we are actually at capacity, so we aren't accepting any new animals into the shelter, um, but we are, you know, striving to find forever homes for the animals that we do have there at this time. You have a lot of people also coming in looking for adoption, but there's a great foster care program, too, that you have with a lot of the people in, in the area. Absolutely. So, you know, if someone cannot provide a forever home for, for one of the animals, but certainly has the ability to provide a temporary home, we do foster out animals and we cover the expenses associated with that animal while they are uh, in a temporary home. <laughs> well, there's a lot of work that's being done and of course the funds raised are, are it's a completely non-profit. You're looking for the community to help out. So then you step in to and are a sponsor of this great show. So it sounds like there's a lot that's going to that's gonna happen on Saturday. There is. This is actually our fifth annual of the Pet Lovers Expo. So it's going to be a, a a good event. Um, as usual, we're going to have the fashion show, which is always a highlight. Uh, this year, we are debuting a new item. Um, some of the dogs may be wearing wigs on Saturday. Oh <laughs> <laughs> you will get to see that. Um, just all the stuff on the runway is really fun, and it's hilarious to watch because you're uh, you can bring your pet to the expo. I mean, as long as they're in control and kept on a leash, and they do their business outside before they come in. Um, they can come in and actually watch the show. And last year, I remember it was hilarious to see all the dogs lined up along the side of the runway watching the dog it was model like fa dogs fashion going week, by. Right? And they were all kind of going, that, that must have been a ton of fun to it see. It was great. It was great. So as well as the fashion show, we also have like the pet photographer who does uh, the photographs and you can get your, your pet done and at an actual like studio setting. Mm -hmm. Um, we'll also have Little Ray's Reptiles there. There'll be all kinds of fun contests that you can enter with your dog. So we have the best trick contest, the best dress contest, and we also have a doggy owner look-alike contest. Oh, those are always really a ton fun. of fun. <laughs> it's actually quite scary when you see how some of them actually really do look yeah. alike. A lot of dogs look like their owners. <laughs> <laughs> when, you, when you talk about uh, products, uh, treats, there's you know a variety of vendors that you'll see there as well. There will be lots of vendors there. Yeah, we've got um, all kinds of people selling treats and um, services and there, there'll be all kinds of rescue groups as well. Mm -hmm. So if you're interested in any different sort of uh, breeds or different animals, there'll be all kinds of uh, people there that can help you and give you lots of information. And then you can look like Chester here and too, right? And you can right? check Chester out there. He'll definitely be there as well. <laughs> that little rain, is that like a rain? A uh, this is his rain jacket. <laughs> yeah, he wears this. It's got a little bit of warmth there. It was kind of chilly this morning. So it was said, chilly. I'd like to wear a jacket, please. And there you have it. He's been he's been amazing actually uh, this entire morning. Just literally standing here waiting to go. I'm like, you're right on cue. For people who uh, can they just buy tickets? It's uh, heading on Saturday. It's you know. Yeah, if you in. want to get tickets in advance, you can get them at our shop at Pause a Bit. We're right in uh, Merrickville at 135 St. Lawrence Street. Um, you can also go online to www.petloverexpo.com and you can buy tickets straight at the door. Straight at the door, you can you have that possibility. And all and the funding's going to laws, so it's a really great cause and we encourage everybody to come out, have fun and that's support a great, a great and, organization. And you want people there, you want people looking for more information because at that point that's where you're at. Right, yeah, exactly. We, you know, we're really grateful. The community has really rallied behind and every day it's just more humbling to see the support that we're getting. So events like this, you know, go to a great cause and it's a bright new future for laws and yeah. Well, hopefully Chester there's some people so that too. can go. <laughs> yeah, I can tell, I can tell. Uh, PetLoverExpo.com if you're looking for more information. Merrickville Community Center in Merrickville, 10 a.m. until 3 p.m. on Saturday. And you are supporting Laws, Lanark Animal Welfare Society. Great to have the two of you here. Thank you and so thank much. And thank you, Chester. You were doing awesome today.